You are unique. There was once something that I saw, I believe it was a Twilight Zone, a uh, long time ago television series. You know, when I tell stories like that, you have to be of my age because when I talk to young people and mention something like that, they'll often just stare at me and not know what in the world is he talking about. Well, the Twilight Zone episode had a man that wished that everybody could be more like him. And pretty soon he was granted his wish and everybody was exactly like him. And it became a very boring life. Diversity and uniqueness of each of us is what makes the life that is so incredible to explore. And I, I don't want other people to be exactly like me. I want to discover their uniqueness. And that includes even religiously. Uh, you know, there, there are wonderful things to discover about other religions. One of my hobbies is to go to churches of other religions that aren't mine and to sit there and worship with them and discover new ways of looking at spirituality and looking at God. In Romans 12, verse 6, it says, Having gifts that differ, differ according to the grace given to us, let us use them. Today, I ask you to join me in brushing aside the habit of comparing yourself with others, of letting another's accomplishments or self-content make you envious or feel unworthy in comparison, because God created you to be unique you realize that we're all on the same path toward harmony with God's divine order. It may look like a different path, but in the end, it is like, like spokes on a wheel leading to the one hub, God. Instead of wasting our time in vain longings for the features of someone else, or the personality of a close friend, or the intelligence of a scholar, we confidently make good and positive evaluations of ourself. We see ourselves the way that God sees us, and we decide to like ourselves. We see that we're a beloved creation of God, and we're endowed with spiritual power, and we are good. It matters not if we're fat, if we're thin, if we're short, if we're tall, what the color of our skin is. We have Christ light of ability within each of us, and we have the ability to grow and to develop in a perfect way because God has placed God's own spirit within each one of us. And this spirit fills us with courage. It fills us with confidence. It assures us of success. We thankfully accept the way that we have been fashioned, affirming in faith in God's special purpose for each one of us. And we realize that God created us, and therefore we like ourselves because we know that God likes us.